Hello everyone, this is Cactus Marsh, back with some Kirby. <laughs> Kirby, Kirby, Kirby. Today's gonna be a practice day, so let's just jump right into it. Practice for any percent. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, practice. Um, let's see, what should we, how should I start this? Um, <laughs> I th I've given up on the uh, copyless King DDD and I'm probably yeah I'm also probably giving up on the Tropic Woods copy list I'm just just not good at the uh, boss fights just not good enough I kind of went over this with Gory Mondo it's like sometimes you just have to recognize you're not good enough so yeah just gonna skip those things go back to our regular strats on Excuse me, I might have the sniffles. <laughs> I'll try to keep it out of the mic, but yeah, I, I've got the sniffles. Okay, but let's start practicing the new stuff. Um, yeah, these two things. Um, we'll practice this first. Because um, the other thing we're going to need to buy a uh, attack boost and speed boost. So let's get... Actually, we don't need anything. Yeah, we can just enter. So, <coughs> I think I just know how to do it. Um, it's just like a hammer jump. The alternate way, that's faster since we struggle at getting the, the fastest way first try and the fastest way is only fast if you get it first try. So, we're doing the second fast way. Since it's easier to get first try, and it's like not that much slower. <clears throat> so yeah, let's learn that. Should hopefully be easy, but I might have to look up a video on how exactly to do it. Oops, got all that. <clears throat> So let's just travel along, make our way downtown. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I, I, yeah. I don't really want to talk about the boss fight thing, because I kind of went over the entire philosophy with the Gordon Mondo thing. That like, sometimes you're just not good enough and you just gotta accept it. <laughs> it sucks, but sometimes you just gotta accept it, but yeah. I think I went over it enough with the Gordon Mondo. Uh, fight. Okay. Oops. Oops. Hold on, I want to test something. Apparently you can just carry over your hammer jump. So let's see. Let's see if we, if we get like a super good hammer jump here. Oh. Maybe we were too fast. <laughs> we didn't even get a jump. That was weird. Oh, maybe you can't hammer jump there. Okay. Let's say you get a super good hammer jump here. Oh, I <laughs> That's not a super good hammer jump. Okay, hold on. I just want to practice this. Because apparently you can carry it over. Okay, can you carry it over? That's what I want to know. You can. That's interesting. I might go for that. I might go for that. And I'll have speed boost during that part, so it'll be even easier to make it since, you know, I'll be in speed mode. So we just need like a decently good a hammer jump for that, I think. So we'll adopt that strat then. Here, you just need to like charge it up for two. Oops. Okay. <laughs> I guess he just ran away. <laughs> he just ran away. Okay, so this is where it is. So if I. Oh. Hold on, that's a bit weird. You gotta. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, 
Gotta get a good hammer jump though. Or at least day hammer jump. Okay, let's see if that hammer jump will work. Oh, it might not work. Okay, I might actually have to look up a video on how to do this. Where am I? Maybe I need a better hammer jump. Hold on, maybe we just need like a better hammer jump. Okay, that's a good hammer jump. Oh no, where am I? Oh, I'm here, and then... Oh, I got stuck. Oh no, I got stuck. I got soft logged. Where am I? Okay, this is weird. I don't like this at all. Where is this place? I have no idea where I am. Oh no, maybe I do need to look up how to do it. Oh no, I'm stuck. <laughs> Will it please teleport me? Oh no, I, I think I might have to look it up. Yeah, I'm stuck. I might. Oh no. I thought this would be easy. What the heck? I'm actually just stuck here. <laughs> okay, we'll uh, we'll look it up. Hold on, we'll look it up. Kirby program skip. Just looking for stuff right now. Is it even called Pogrom Skip? <laughs> um, I should have probably looked this up beforehand. I apologize. <laughs> Probably should have, okay. Um, okay. Um, hold on. <laughs> I really should have looked up how to do it beforehand. Okay, we'll table this then. Oh no, I'm so unprepared for this stream. Oh no, I'm so unprepared. Okay, we can we can practice this though. So let's return. Get like an attack boost and a speed boost and practice this. The Gory Mondo thing. That should be easy to practice. Man. <laughs> I don't know how to do the boat room thing. Oh no. Okay, speed boost, attack boost. <laughs> really should have been prepared this. Whoops. Ooh, okay. Let's just at least try this one. This should be in theory easy, but I thought the other one was gonna be easy. Whoops, I don't want to buy that. Okay, attack boost. Up my attack. Give it to me. Attack boost. Oops, I was trying to get rid of my ability, but... Okay, I'll just do a quick look to see how long he charges the um, crash ability. 
Just a quick look. Okay. So, video. Watch. Um, where's the level? It is here. Okay, so he, yeah, dashes into the level. And then, hold on, so that's, okay, so you only have to charge it, like, to the first phase, to, like, the, the glowing blue thing, okay, the glowing blue thing, gotcha, don't have to charge it that much, oh man, I gotta sneeze, <laughs> <coughs> Bless me. <laughs> I apologize for sneezing. Okay. Get crash. Run up this way. And then the blue. Okay. Yeah, you kill, you, you beat up Gory Mondo, and then, and then you just ride at the car, and I think you, like, skip part of the road section. Yeah, you skip part of this. Let's see how easy it is to skip. Uh, you can just jump this, right? Yeah. Yeah, here is where you go, so you just, oh, no, okay, it is hard, it's, it, it is hard, okay. You can't turn around and die. <laughs> Okay, it is, hold on, hold on, this is a bit, um, I'm gonna have to get used to this, I'm gonna have to, oh, okay, I'm gonna have to get used to this, okay, I'll practice this a bit, I'll practice that a bit, that is, a uh, very tight steering, <laughs> okay, that's, uh, actually, you know what, I can just practice it here, oh, wait, no, but I gotta bring the car with me, <laughs> I don't have to redo the level, I can just, Bring the car back to the starting point. Can I just do that? Yeah, I can just do that. Okay. Attempt number two. So here to here to full stop. And then okay. Okay. <laughs> I was. I guess it was a bit easier than I thought. I was just totally unprepared because that was literally my first time doing it. Okay. Let's try it a third time, and if we got it a third time, then we can just try practicing something else. So go here, full stop turn. Okay. And in fact, you could probably cut that corner too. Yeah, you can probably cut a lot of corners. Okay. Not a bad thing. So this one was easy to, easy to learn. Okay. Any of those? Oh, let's, uh, oh, I have the freaking speed boost. I gotta get rid of this speed boost. Cause you, I want to practice something where you won't have a speed boost. Well, let's just spend some time in this level, I guess. We can just burn the speed boost here. Practice some movement in this level, might as well. Man, this this level just looks like a moon crater, but it's not. It's just a, it's just a crater, <laughs> on Earth. We have those, right? We have Earth craters, right? Do we? Wait, do we? <laughs> uh. Craters, don't they have to be, like, from asteroid impacts or something? I don't know. I don't know the actual definition of what a crater is. I don't know. I'm clueless. Okay. Man, you move so fast at speed, Kirby. It's so nice. It's so nice to just move this fast. No. Oh. But you still get hit. <laughs> still get beat up by the dang uh, rocks, whatever they are. Okay, we can at least practice this upcoming thing where you just carry your um, hammer jump and you don't do a second one. So here, if you get a good one, I think you can just carry it. Yeah, so we should, in theory, be able to just carry this over on top of this building. So, holding forward. Yeah. Okay, that works out really nice. I'm just going to do that from now on. I'm just 
gonna do that from now on. It's just so much simpler. Oh, there goes my speed boost. Okay, we got rid of our speed boost, but uh, let me practice this part. Probably not gonna be able to do it, but at least give it a second attempt. Ah, oh, dang it. I totally hit that guy. Um, I totally hit him. Okay. I'm gonna have to just look up how to do this skip offline, cause I thought it would have been easy, but let's see, let's give it one last go around. So if we, oh, <laughs> we need to get a hammer jump. So if we get like a, a good hammer jump, ah, oh, dang it. My hammer jump timings are not on right now. I am not ready to do hammer jumps right now. Okay, that's a terrible hammer jump. There we go. Okay, if we just make the gate come back, hold on, where am I? Oh, I thought if we made the gate come back, we could have just walked back inside. Hold on, let me try. Yeah, man, my hammer jumps are not good right now. Um, I have no idea where I am. <laughs> I have no idea how this skip works. Yeah, I'll probably, I'll give it a couple more tries, but then I'll probably just have to look it up online. Do you have to go like left? So if I fall back down. No, okay, so you can't fall back down. That will just make the gate come back. So I'm assuming you have to do everything floating. Except I have no idea where I am right now. Where am I? Okay. <laughs> One more try. Let's, let's try just doing max height. If you have like max height, does that change anything? Max height. can't tell. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, so that's the skip. Um, you just have to do it better <laughs> than what I did. Okay, so you have to, so like, you know that tunnel that we were in? You have to be on the left hand of the tunnel. You can't be on top of it. Okay, left hand of the tunnel. Yeah, we'll We'll do a bit more practice of that, but probably off stream. Um, okay. I'll have to, I'll have to get used to that. That That's a very weird one. Uh, so you just have to be like left of the tunnel, I think. Okay. Um, hold on. I, I want to practice, uh, conquer the inferno road, but I need the fire ability. I need the fire ability for that. So let's just quickly switch up to fire. I want to get the, uh, when you swap from fire to crash, I want to get that swap, um, like, d very well done. I want to, like, make it a clean swap. I don't want to have to, like, juggle everything and, like, take so much time to set it up. I want to just do it and then, you know, <laughs> just do it good. Okay. So here we go. Conquer the Inferno Road. Man, I've practiced this level so many times. Jeez. Well, let's give it like another go around. Okay. Just stick to the essentials. Dodge the snake. Go above these guys since we had bad timing there. Oh, I didn't know I didn't know you could do that. Good to know. Okay, so here we just do like this. Oh, I have to turn around. Oh no, I'm too slow. Okay. <laughs> That's this is what I want to do. I wanna make this switch clean. But as you can see, it's it's tough to make that switch clean. You have to Keep your fire ability on those, like, disappearing blocks, and then swallow that crash, dude. 
Okay, we're gonna be here a while, guys, just as a heads up. We're gonna be here for a long while, just practicing this over and over again. It's gonna take a long time, heads up, so sit back, relax, you know. <laughs> Hopefully, don't get tilted at some of the bad gameplay that's gonna happen. <laughs> that's more to me. I, I don't wanna get tilted. <laughs> I get tilted so easily from practice, because. The pros make it look so easy. Oh, that's not gonna work. Oh, uh, my R button wasn't responding. And then it's just like that. And then you have to be in the air. Okay, it, it didn't work, so. I think in that scenario we were too slow and our fire ability uh, just ran out. So you can't let the you can't let the fire ability touch the lava because then it'll it'll die. But the fire ability will also just disappear after a certain amount of time. So you have to be fast. Um, oh, I thought the window was a bit easier, but maybe it's not. Maybe it's not. Uh, I'll give it a couple more tries. But we might just have to do it a slow way. I might just not be good enough to do it a fast, clean way. I might just have to do it the slow way where you just like... Go on the like the ground and not the disappearing blocks. And just like juggle the abilities or something like that. It's kind of tough to explain, but uh... <laughs> I might just have to be slow. Slow and steady wins the race, kinda. Not really. Not really, but it kinda does. It kinda does. I'm just trying to be able to get as much time save as I can by implementing the best tricks, but I can't do the best tricks. Oh, I can't do the best tricks. And I've, you know, like made peace with that. Because it sucks not being able to be like the cool dude and do all the cool tricks. It sucks, but I've made peace. Oops. I've made peace. Sometimes you just have to accept that you can't do everything. Sometimes you just have to accept that. Oops. Oh, that was unfortunate. I bonked into the snake. That's the first time that's ever happened. Okay. Let's focus up. So... We fire dash. No, you don't want to fire dash. Okay, yeah, yeah you don't want to fire dash because you get stuck in the animation for too long. You want to dash, dash, that. You want to do that, yeah. You want to do that. Your, your ability lands there. I just want to see how long it lasts. How long does this fire ability last? I feel like it's a fair amount of time. Yeah, that was like a fair amount of time. Okay, let's practice that movement once more. So, you're here. Let's say you just finished the fire dash. You dash, dash, turn around, and then like try to swallow. Okay, so no fire dashes in this final segment. Just one land dash into another land dash. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> let's try it, you know. See if that actually works, if we're fast enough. Because we have to be fast enough to solve the crash dude before he, you know, self-explodes. And then we have to be fast enough to actually use the crash ability before a fire ability uh, disappears. Have to be fast, fast, fast. Speed's the name of the game, unfortunately. Speed is the name. Oh, what the? Okay. Uh, we're, okay, yeah, we're, uh, hold on, we're, <laughs> don't look at this movement, this movement's bad. <laughs> don't look at me, <laughs> this movement's bad. Okay, hold on, focus, so, you do a fire dash and then dash, dash, turn around. Oh my goodness, wait, hold on, I can't make it, I can't make it in time. Um, I cannot make it in time to save the crash, dude. Let's hold on. We we do this. 
we do that, we might not have to dash here. Just do dash, land, jump, turn around. Yeah, let's try that. Let's try not dashing on the uh, disappearing blocks. Maybe we just don't have enough time for that. <coughs> oh man, my, my throat's getting a bit dry. My throat. It's too dry. Oops. Oops, almost touched the lava. Okay, so... Dash. Just go here. Charge. Do. Then... Give it one more shot. <laughs> we'll give that one more shot. We'll see. We'll see. We'll give that one more attempt. <laughs> I thought we would have more time. More time. Ooh. Okay, let's go. This will be it. <laughs> this is the one. I can feel it. Okay, fire dash to start with. Oh, oops. Oops, okay, that was a bit weird. My depth perception was off. As always. As always. It's just so hard to keep track of yourself in a 3D platformer. Like the shadow house, but you're not really looking at your shadow, you're looking at Kirby. Ooh, we're just gonna have to do that. Okay. just do not have the time. We don't have the time. Hold on, maybe... Maybe it has to be closer. Maybe it does have to be closer. I'll give it one shot. Maybe the fire ability has to be closer to the ladder. Because maybe like... Everything else despawns unless it's close enough to the ladder. I don't know, I'm just coming up with excuses at this point. <laughs> coming up with excuses. Just has maybe it was just getting like despawned by something. Maybe it just has to be close to the ladder. Okay, so let's try this. We're gonna do it the slow way. We're gonna do it the slow way. So, oops. Do your movement. Up over that. 
Oh, dang it. I got too greedy. Okay. So here, just do this. Do that. Do this. Do that. Okay, now this should work. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna be losing my mind. Okay. There we go. I think it does have to be close to the ladder. I think that's the whole thing, how it works. Okay. Trick learned. Gotta be close to the ladder. Cause probably just needs like an area to effect to despawn. Um, let's practice the skip again. See if we can just come up with it on our own. Let's just practice it again. But yeah, we're luckily learning some of these tricks, some of them. Some of them. <laughs> oh, what the? You can shoot an airborne? Bullet. I haven't seen that before, at least in this level. I know in general they can shoot airborne bullets, but never seen them do it in this level before. Okay, let's just run through this level. We don't have our speed boost, so this isn't really oof, indicative of what we're going to be doing when we get to this level. Okay, and then here, let's practice this thing again. Oh, it might not work since we don't have speed boost. It's definitely easier with speed boost. Oh, it worked. Wow. Okay, yeah, we're definitely just doing that from now on. We're definitely just doing that from now on. Oops. Ooh. Okay. Let's just practice this. Oh, he goes so fast. I keep forgetting he just like instantly goes. Keep forgetting that. Okay. So remember, we gotta be to the left of this tunnel. Gotta be to the left. Oops. It's kinda tough to do this hammer jump since you can't really see the ground because it's obscured by the tunnel. Okay, go left. Okay, um. I guess you just need a lot of height, so you just need a good hammer jump. Okay, go left. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll figure out how to do that faster. <laughs> but yeah, that's the trick. We'll figure out how to do that faster. But yeah. <laughs> Anything else we wanted to practice? Oh yeah, we wanted to practice that stupid thing. Oof. Dang it, yeah, let's just practice that. Okay, um, stage list. Wondaria, welcome to Wondaria. 
Okay, I want to practice if we can get this ability roulette set up. Hold on. Let me get the fire ability. I know there's just a fire dude sitting around there. Give me it. Okay, I'm gonna look up... Because Polka does it. I know Polka does it in his run, so let's watch Polka's POV. Okay. Um, gotta find the level. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, hold on. Did he change it? Or am I just misremembering? Oh, I think I am misremembering, right? Yeah, okay, I was just misremembering, so... Hold on, I gotta... Okay. Yeah, I was just misremembering. Okay, so he... In the room. Dash, dash, fire, dash. Dash, dash, fire, dash. Hold on, I need to see this again. Dash, dash, fire, dash. Okay, one more time. One, one more time. He makes it just look so easy. Dash, dash. Are these, I need to see, are these quick dashes? Does he like, I think these are quick dashes. Yeah, these are quick dashes. Okay. Let's try it. If I try it, I mean get to the room and then try it. Because <laughs> we still have to get there. Hold on, let me get this carrot. Oops. Oops. Can you stand on this? No, you can't really. If only you could get an ability roulette here, it would have been so much easier. But no, you can't. These guys don't give abilities. Yeah, see, you just get ice. If only you could have done that. <laughs> that would have been so much easier. But no, they don't give abilities. Okay, so it was dash, dash, fire, dash. Okay. Oh, I missed. I missed. How easy is it to, like, fix it? Where's the other dude? Man, I, <laughs> the one time I... Uh, the one time my dash doesn't home in on the enemy. The one time your dash doesn't home in. That's so infuriating. When you want your dash to home in onto the enemy and it doesn't. Bruh, that's so annoying. Okay, I really want to get this. We almost got it that first time, we just missed our freaking dash. Oh yeah, now you home in. Now you home in onto the enemy. I think we did our dash too early. It's my assumption. It's just my guess. Dang it, it's easy to bonk here. <laughs> but I'm realizing- Oh yeah, now you're homing in on the enemies. Man, when you dash- When you want your dash to work with you, it never does. Okay. Dash, dash, fire, dash. Dash, dash, fire, dash. Wait. Oh, you can't wait. Okay, you can't wait cannot wait. You just have to go. Okay. No waiting allowed. Got you. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. No waiting allowed. Oops. Okay, let's just, we're gonna be here for a while. We're gonna just be practicing this over and over again. Okay, just over and over again. Oh, 
Okay, so... <laughs> attempt, man. And you can't even, like... It takes a while to actually get back to the room to practice it, unfortunately. It takes a while. Okay, let's go. So, dash, dash, fire dash. Oh my goodness. What the heck? Okay, there... Hold on, I need to... I need to look at his dash. How do you... Does he, like, do his dash differently? Hold on. That last dash, how do you knock them up there? How do you knock them up there? Okay, so... Oh, he does walk a bit. Hold on. Hold on. New development. Okay, so I think you just gotta get, like, right up next to him. Oh, there's not another, there's not another one that I can just practice on. I have to <laughs> restart the level. Okay, so you don't do the dash to knock him up immediately. You, like, you gotta get very close to him. It's gotta be, like, a point-blank dash, basically. That's what I'm learning. Point blank dash. Knock him up. Point blank. Ooh. Okay. Point blank. Let's go. He walks like a tiny bit. You got this, you got this. Man, why does it take so long to practice this? Okay, let's go. Let's go! Oh, and then you go... Oh no, you have to be... Oh man. You have to be fast. Hold on, there might be an easier setup, I'm just realizing. Just now realizing there might be an easier setup. You do this. No. Hold on, hold on, wait. Let me let me experiment. Let me experiment. So do this. Do that, that thing is that spiky's in the way. Okay, you do that. I shouldn't have done it so high up in the air. Okay, hold on, let's <laughs> let's reset. I I I need to See if there's an easy way to do this. Um, can you swallow two abilities at once to get the roulette? Dang it, it's gonna run out of time. Okay, hold on. No, you can't. Can't swallow two abilities at the same time to get the roulette. What if you swallow a ability and a monster? Hold on, let me kill this dude. Hold on. It's a bit unfortunate. Okay. Dang it. Hold on. Uh, it's gonna prioritize the ability, I think. It's not gonna prioritize the dude. Yeah, it's prioritizing the ability. Okay. So you can't really swallow that and that. Um, I'm trying to think. Cause you have to be fast cause the spiky guy will just come back downwards. <laughs> and I don't like being fast cause I'm not fast. I can't be fast. Hold on, let's... Okay, let's... Hold on. Hold on. New idea. Let's punch the ice dude downwards instead of the spiky dude upwards. Okay, new idea. Ice guy down. Let's try that. 
Ice guy down. Let's try that. It won't be as fast, but it might be easier. It might be easier. Oof. Might be easier. Because that's like the only really ability roulette you can set up because woofies don't give you abilities and that fire guy's just there by himself and you need to set up the ability roulette with enemies the bunnies don't give you abilities this cutter guy's just by himself And then this nice guy's just surrounded by bunnies that don't give you abilities. Yeah, it's the only roulette you can set up. Get out of here, monkey dude. And you can't swallow two guys with the same ability to get the roulette. Okay. Oops. Well, that's fine. We don't need fire ability, so... Okay, unfortunately it takes a while. Oh, but what? Oh, dang it. I was gonna say, what if- hold on. Can we even- stop doing your ability. Okay, it's actually- okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I don't actually need fire ability, do I? <laughs> You're right, I don't need fire ability. Why did I go back to get fire ability? I don't need it. Fire ability is just at the beginning. Let's see, can we knock up the ice dude into the hammer dude? Let's see. Can we knock up ice dude into a hammer dude? Problem with ice dude is that he just does his annoying abilities that have priority over everything. Okay, I'm actually gonna get some of the food here. Get this carrot. We are taking too much damage. Too many bonks. Yeah. Ice dudes are just annoying. Okay. Okay, so let's try getting Ice Dude knocked up. Yeah, he goes here. He goes here. Oops. Okay, I don't think we can do that. I don't think we can knock up the ice dude. Look. What about... I mean, you can knock this guy down, right? Okay, you can knock him there. How many hits can he take? Can he take another hit? No, he dies if he takes another hit. Oh, now he doesn't fall down. What the heck? Why did our guy fall down? That first spiky dude. Why did he fall down? This guy's not falling down. What the heck? Why did our guy fall down? Bruh. Okay, looks like we have to do spiky dude and ice dude. Let's just try it again. Let me see, so when does Polka get rid of his fire ability? Hold on. I need to pull that video up again. Polka, when do you, so you dash, dash, fire dash, knock up, get rid of ability, and then swallow. Okay. So you do it right after you do the knock-up. Hold on, I need, I need to look at it again. <laughs> I need to look at it again. Dash, dash, fire dash, knock-up. Okay. Let's, let's just give it some more attempts. Because this would help us so much if we could get this. It would help us so much. 
please. Let me get this. Let me get this carrot. After you do the knock-up, get rid of your ability. Okay. Let's do this. Dash. Dash. Fire dash. Oh, I'm not fast enough. Hold on. Okay. And then... We just get tornado. Well, it would be, it would be different because this would be, it would be different. It would be different. Okay. I think we'll just try that. We can wait for them to go around their circuit. How many uh, close quarters contact hits can they take? Because I think they take damage when they collide with us. Okay, they can take like three. Okay. Yeah, it'll be different because we won't have as many abilities <laughs> to cycle through in the roulette. We won't, so... Honestly, that was kind of everything I wanted to practice. <laughs> that I could practice. <laughs> that I could do. I think I'm just going to end it a bit early. Um... You know, like, sleep on what we learned, do it again tomorrow, and if we can do it again tomorrow, after, you know, this prolonged time, then things are looking good. So, I think I'll just end it early. <laughs> um, yeah. One thing, one quick thing I want to talk about is just, um, you saw how happy I was when I got the 152, and then immediately after, next stream, I was looking for ways to improve our time even though I was like beyond happy with the 152 and then I ended up getting tilted. Um, so the main reason why I want to improve my time is because I know I can still do it. I'm like very happy with the 152 and it was like very amazing but I do know it can be a bit better. Well <laughs> it's funny because it at the end of the 152, I said, like, there's no way I can beat it unless I, like, get better. <laughs> but I can beat it. I can implement new techniques, and, and I, I can be better. So that's why I want to, you know, I still want to get a, a better time. Even though the 152 was amazing, I still want to beat it. Even if it causes me, you know, getting tilted and mad. All this, uh, you know, all this anger and just getting tilted is, is temporary. It's not like, you know, any permanent. I, I don't know. I'm just like being philosophical here or just like talking about, you know, mental health. Because one could argue that I should have just been happy with the 152 and just, you know, embraced it and just not had tried to, you know, not stressed over trying to beat it. But... I think I can beat it. I think I can push myself and learn some new techniques to beat it. Or at least use better strats at my skill level. So I can beat it, and because I can, I, I want to push myself to that. Even if it's like, can have moments where it's not fun, because not everything's always going to be fun. But, like, sometimes when you want to have fun, you have to do things that aren't fun. That's just, you know how things work sometimes you have to put in the work you have to put in the hard work and you know actually grind it out and actually you know work towards having fun because it's worth it <laughs> it's worth it when you get that amazing time it, it's just worth it that's when you have the most fun when you put in all this time and effort and it gets rewarded that's that's the joy that's what speedrunning is all about Although I could just be, you know, speedrunning for fun and just, you know, relaxing. But, um, like I can do that, but I just want to get this PB. I want to push for this PB. 
And then once we have, you know, the, like, one of the, once we have a PB that I, like, know for sure that there's, like, very much no way I can beat it, then I can just relax and, um, just speedrun for fun. But, um, I don't think I'm at that point yet. I know <laughs> during the 152 I said that I was, like, probably at that point, but, you know, I think after doing some more research, I can still push it. I can still push it. And then we can rest. And then we can just speed run for fun. But I, I want to do this push for the PB. It'll be fun. It'll be... The, the, the work might not be fun, but it'll be worth it. It'll be worth it. So that's kind of just what where I've been at recently, like mental-wise. Like, yes, this is annoying. And yes, it's like frustrating. But it's all for the sake of a good reason. And... It's worth it, at least for me. So, yeah, <laughs> that was my uh, philosophical talk 101 from Cactus Marsh. Hopefully you learned something. <laughs> Apologize. But yeah, I'll, I'll be ending stream. So thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And uh, hopefully see you guys later. Peace. Bye bye.